My name is Dr. Michael Brisman, and I am a neurosurgeon on Long Island. There has been much publicity recently on surprise medical bills received by patients who believed they had full insurance coverage for their needed health care, but unfortunately did not. Right now, S-2551 is a bill under discussion in Albany that will prevent insurance companies from selling virtually worthless health insurance policies to patients and their employers. If enacted, S-2551 will provide much needed transparency as to what their insurance actually covers when they pay extra for the right to see the doctor of their choice, whether or not the physician participates in the patient's plan. Without this legislation, patients could face a major financial burden if they or their family members find themselves in need of highly specialized medical care. A major cause of this problem is that insurance companies have drastically reduced their coverage in policies that cover care provided by out-of-network physicians. Because the amount the insurer covers is often far less than the usual charges for this care, patients find themselves facing completely unexpected, enormous financial responsibility. Again, this is the result of health plans drastically reducing coverage despite the fact that their premiums keep going up radically every year. Now you might be asking, I'm an in-network physician, why does this bill matter to me? You need to know that this issue is important for all physicians. Here's why. We are all well aware that there are one or two insurers that are the dominant players in New York State. Most physicians have little, if any, ability to negotiate patient care with these behemoths. Often, the only leverage physicians have to assure greater clinical control of their patient's care is simply to refuse to participate in a plan. If health plans are permitted to make grossly inadequate payments for care when provided by out-of-network physicians, these plans will have absolutely no incentive to negotiate in good faith with a physician. Your right to walk away from these one-sided contracts would essentially be meaningless. Physicians would be forced to be even more at the mercy of insurance companies. This legislation, S2551, is critically important not only to protect our patients' ability to access care from the physician of their choice, but also to protect your ability to be treated fairly by an insurance company. It is imperative that you contact your legislators to urge your support for this bill. Go to the MISNI website at www.mssny.org to send a letter in support. Equally important, please let your patients know the importance of S2551 and urge them to take action as well. Don't let the insurance companies get away with enriching their bottom line at the expense of you and your patients. Time is running out for the legislature to act. Please take action today.